guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my thought on spring break. So my friend and I went to Daytona, Florida for spring break. We drove. It took 18 hours. I would definitely do it again, but I would go to a different part of Florida. Um, it was really cold. We actually had two days where it was in the 70s, which is not fun at all, but we may do. On Monday, we went to Epcot, and I have never been to Epcot, so that was an interesting trip. I have watched many vlogs in Epcot, and it looked so amazing, but when I actually went, I did not enjoy it as much as I thought I would. Just how it was perceived on YouTube made it look so much fun. I mean, don't get me wrong, I had fun I just don't think it was worth the money in my opinion I guess I'm just more of a thriller rides roller coaster person I really love Universal so it was just like kind of heartbreaking that I didn't go to Universal for the second time that I went to Florida by myself um, but it was fun I will post my vlogs in the description box and up above so you guys can check those out but yeah I'm gonna show you what I got the first thing I got was a pair of mini ears. This is my first ever pair. I'm so happy that I, I'm so happy that I was finally able to get a pair. I just feel so much better. And these are so cute. They are the rose gold one, sequin, but I really love them. But I just, when I, I'm a person that when I want something, I want it now. And if I can't get it, hmm. it's gonna be hard. So as soon as we got to the front gates, I went and purchased this for $40. Cause some, for some reason, I didn't think there would be any mini ears in the park, but I'm, I don't know. I came to realize that there are many places in Epcot where you can get ears, and I paid too much for these. They were $27, and I paid $40, so I'm like a little annoyed that I could not wait to buy ears, but that's okay. I still got them, and I absolutely love them. I also, the next couple days, a tarot reader. This is one of my favorite things to do is to get my cards read and I just love it. And the first thing that I got was this bracelet. It has all of our seven chakras. So beautiful. I love it. And then the white beads are how light and that's just like with anxiety and stress to like calm you down. Also bought a selenite rod and this is just to recharge your bracelets when you need to. I got this because I've been wanting this for a long time. This was pretty pricey but it charges your bracelet so I don't have to set them out in the moonlight or wash them and do it that way. This is really deal. And then I also had my cards read. And then when it was really cold, we went to Cocoa Beach. We laid out on the beach for the day. It was still a little bit cold, but we loved it. I have been to I have not been to Cocoa Beach in so long. And after that, we went to a mall that had the Ron John Surf Shop. I made that one of the places I wanted to visit because I didn't do it last year. And that's like one of the, my favorite things to do is to go to the surf shop and just get stickers and souvenirs because I don't know when the next time I will be in Florida. Got was these air fresheners for my car and it says the secret to having it all is knowing that you already do. I love this one so much. And then I bought another one. I love them. They're very expensive, but what do you expect? You're in Florida. I thought it was okay to buy that. Other things I bought from Ron John Surf Shop is a key ring wristlet because I don't have one. This is really cute. You just snap it on and you can put it on your wrist. And then I also got I also bought this keychain and it says you are my sunshine, and then it has a little Ron John detailing right there. I thought that is so cute. I also bought my other brother a um, shark bottle cap opener keychain. I think it's really cool, and he's 22, so I thought it would come in handy. And yeah, third Wednesday, I visited a CBD shop, and I just bought some CBD lotion. This is to rub on your body wherever it hurts. So if I when I have back pain and leg pain, I put this on, and this just really relaxes the muscles and it feels so good and then I also got a CBD pen to vape when I am feeling stressed out or about to have an anxiety attack which I have so very often it has been really helpful and it's like mint so it is really tasty and no one ever notices it and then I also just bought some sunscreen. This is this is SPF 50. I needed this so bad. I'm so glad I paid for it. This works really well. It kept me from getting sunburned, except for two places. I forgot to put this on the, my upper back and my feet because I didn't know that my feet would burn, but it did. My feet and my upper back were hurting for like three days straight. It was so bad. But yeah, this is so good. Everywhere else I put this on, I didn't get a sunburn, which was nice. We were out on the beach for about four 
four hours before we had to make the trip home and it was great i am so tan can you tell my tan lines i don't know but yeah i'm so happy that we had to have i'm so happy but i'm so happy that we were able to be out there for a couple hours and tan i cannot wait for the summer now honestly i just think i need to live in florida because the weather was great just being in florida is such an amazing atmosphere i felt so much better and at peace so hopefully in the future i will move to florida yeah overall the experience was really fun especially for our budget i think we did some good stuff that is pretty much my experience in daytona i would recommend going back in the summertime like maybe may late april because it was so cold thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video of what i got from in florida in my experience i hope you enjoyed and i will see you guys in my next video bye